If your Android screen freezes and you tap on it and nothing is happening, here is a solution for that. So first of all, we have to understand the causes of this issue. So sometimes it may be caused by the software apps, by some third party apps, right? And it may be basically software issue. If it's a software issue, it's quite easy to manage and I will show you the ways of doing this. However, if it is a hardware issue, so for example, you dropped your phone screen down and now it's irresponsive, most likely it is a hardware issue. So the only way out of this is to visit your local Samsung service center. All right, let's start with the fix. And so if you're using any kind of Android uh, older than 8.0 you are to hold your power button so locate it and hold it for 30 seconds and your phone will complete a force restart however if you are using a samsung like i do try holding a power button plus volume down button simultaneously so hold them even if your power off menu appears your screen is responsive right you will not use it so simply hold it until your screen will go dark and now the research process will begin. So as you see, oh, my phone is getting restarted. Give it a couple seconds to do that. Also, if your phone has a physical home button, or like right here, like on the old Samsung, or basically all old Android phones, you are to hold power button, volume down button, and home button, which is located right here, right? If your phone doesn't restart, repeat the previous tab. So try either power button or volume down plus power button combination, right? Also, uh, we can boot up our phone into the safe mode to check if the app is causing the issue. So to do that, once again, turn off your phone. To turn off your phone, you are to hold your volume down button and power button. After that, release them, hold your power button and volume down button again. And after phone, after your phone will start to boot up, hold your volume down button. Keep on holding them until he will boot up completely. And here we are, as you see, we're in the safe mode. So now swipe up to unlock. Right, and if your screen works here, it means that your phone may have software issues. Some third party app is causing this issue. So, once again, power it off, tap on the safe mode, press turn off, give your phone a couple seconds to boot up into normal mode, and uh, delete all the recently installed apps. Uh, if your phone has a removable battery, you may take it out, wait a minute, and then reinsert it and try to turn it back on. Also ensure that a screen protector or a case isn't interfering with a touch screen. Remove them, clean the screen with a soft cloth, and check if your screen is working again. Our last resort is gonna be performing a factor reset while recovery mode. So to do that, first of all, make sure to plug in to your phone. So locate your charging port, plug it in, plug it to a computer, or sometimes it's even okay if you plug it just into the power socket. However, I recommend plugging it into a computer. In my case, I don't know why, but sometimes when you're plugging it in somewhere else, uh, the recovery mode just don't start. So once again, hold your power button and volume down button until the phone will restart. And after that, hold your power button and volume up button. So hold them until you will appear into your recovery mode. Now you can navigate through it using your volume up and volume down button. So choose your wipe data factory reset option, press on this power button to confirm your choice, then choose your factory data reset and once again press your power button. 
After that, choose reboot system now and check whether your screen are working. Also, when you're doing a factory reset, don't forget to back up your important data because otherwise it will be lost. And basically, that's it. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day and please consider subscribing to our channel.